Hello and welcome to the another set of uh, uh, data structure and algorithm lesson and in uh, this lesson we are going to learn BFS. BFS referred as breadth first search and, uh, uh, and it's a graph algorithm and it can be applied over tree also. Most of the crawling application uh, the curl operation uh, runs on BFS. It's a uh, uh, in this algorithm, we will learn two techniques. One is uh, which node we are visiting and how we can mark it and, uh, and after marking how we are going to traverse. So now we will do a BFS and uh, then we will try to write the algorithm. Uh, so the BFS is first take the root element from the graph and add it into the queue. So I will take A the first root element and add this in a queue. Let's say I have a queue. I will add A into the queue. Okay. So then what I do, I will and then I will try to find what are the edges I can reach from A. So I can reach B, I can reach B, C. So I will and queue A and add the if you want draw graph A. B and C. Okay, so I will NQ A. Sorry, I will DQ A from this queue and B and C into the queue. So B and C is currently element in this queue. Okay, so now we take next element D. So from D I can reach to D and E. Okay, so I will DQB and add D and E. Okay, so the Q will become C, D and E. Okay, and I will mark B as visited. Okay, now now we are visiting the next uh, element in the queue C. Okay, so when I come to C, I can see that I can reach to E, I can reach to G. Okay, so I will DQC and mark it, and I can add other element to the queue. Okay, so C is uh, DQ, so next element is G come into the queue, E is already present, so uh, we don't want to put again E into the queue. Okay, so the next visiting element is D. So once I come to D, I can see I can go to F only. So I will DQ D and add F into the queue. And I will mark B as visited. Okay. Now, now the next element is E. So from E, I can come to uh, B, C, and F. So B and C are already visited, and uh, F is already in the queue. So I will dequeue it without adding anything extra from the key in the queue. So my element will be. G and F and I will mark E as visited. Okay. So so the next element I will take from G is so from, uh, from G I can find C and F. So C is already visited. So I will DQ G and mark it. Sorry, this one. And the final uh, last element will be remain F. So from F, I can go to E, D, and G. But all the E, D, and G are visited. So finally, my queue will be empty. Okay. So in this way, we have traversed the entire graph. So if you want 
to implement this BFS in our code, we need to uh, keep track of two nodes, one node which is not visited and one node which are visited. Okay. So in front of me I have VFS and uh, I want to implement this in our code logic and uh, so what I have to do is uh, I create two queues one with say not visited and one say visited okay first I will, what I will do I will put the root node A okay and uh, we will mark this okay and then we will do after marking we will dequeue it and put into A okay before putting it A we will find the adjacent of A that is B and E okay now what we will do after marking and putting to A we will remove from this queue okay so next element what is not visited is B so when we visit B we will mark V, B okay and add it to the visited section and dequeue it from here and after dequeuing we will find adjacent of B that is uh, A, C and D so A is already visited so we will put C and D in the not visited section okay so now next come is E so when it comes to E, I can see A and D. So A is already visited. First thing we have to do, we will mark A. Mark E and A is already visited. We will put D. D is already present. Then what we will do? We will remove from here, not visited section and put into the visited section. So after putting the visited section, uh, my next element is C. So from C I can go to B and D so B is already visited and D D is already present in the not visited section so we will remove from the not visited section we will mark this C and we will add this into visited section now next come D so from D I can go to B, C and E so all B, C, E and R are visited ok so we will remove from the not visited queue and add into the visited queue. Okay, in this way we will traverse the entire VFS. So two things: maintain a queue which is not visited and maintain a queue which is visited and uh, perform your business operation in between. Thank you.